The Carnegie Heritage Centre is based at the gates of West Park on Underby Road in Hull. It's a Grade Two listed building and was built in 1905 with money from Andrew Carnegie. It was run as a library for nearly 100 years and then when it closed, people in the local community sort of got together and negotiated with the council to, um, to take it over. And we run the building as a resource for local history and family history. But we're all volunteers um, and everyone comes here because they enjoy coming. Well, the project is to commemorate the R-38 airship disaster, which happened in 1921. The R-38 was um, one of the, the most important airships to be built, and the British government were selling it to the Americans. And on this, this flight, there was 49 crew, 50% American, 50% English. It was on its last test flight, and as it came up, um, up the Humber, the, um, it tried to do a very tight turn and it burst into flames. This was seen by obviously anyone in Hull who was around, you know, was outside at the time. And out of the 49 crew, the only five survived. Well, the main bulk of the money has been to pay our web designer. People came forward with stories that they heard from their uh, grandparents and, uh, and artifacts. And it was amazing that people collect bits of the wreckage, you know, even tiny bits of the, the, the airship material. And then the stories were very good. So we wanted to put it onto our website and make it available to, uh, to people to hear about it and understand the disaster. And that's really where the um, Humber Museum's partnership came in. It's taken quite a lot of um, my time up. The time that it's taken, say, for the Zoom meetings and then all the reports and things that they ask for, the support is there. We've made other contacts. So, yes, we, you know, we've made contact with other people who've got the same funding, so that's been interesting. It's certainly, yeah, it's certainly raised our profile. Um, we've had more people coming in and we've had, uh, you know, more people keeping in contact with us. People have um, enjoyed reading all the information. You know, it is an ongoing project and I don't think it'll ever be finished.